up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Black Walkthrough. So, as you can see right here, we're standing like uh, true pimps right here. Defeated three out of the four Elite Four members, and now, we gotta take on one more. We don't need to research who it is, we already know, it. her name is Caitlyn. And look at that, it's all mystic in here. Holy crap, baskets. These guys have like interesting, uh, interesting themes right here. I wanna have a room for myself, like as a champion, with like, intricate puzzles and all that crud. Oh damn, she is in a... Oh wow, she's in a bed. Oh my, oh my. Hmm, look at that. She's waking up. How you doing, Caitlyn? It's me, your destiny, Draven. About to kick your butt. Okay, so uh, before we do anything, hold on just a sec. Uh, yeah, she does have four Pokemon right here, so let's go right ahead and analyze what we're going to be doing right here. So, she does have Psychic-type Pokemon. I do have Shatter, Gigalith, Ace, and I would like to say, yeah, these three Pokemon right here that can actually beat her. So, I'm going to take that risk and go with Shatter right here. And, uh, let's go. Who are you? How impotent you are to disturb my sleep. Hmm. You appear to possess a combination of strength and kindness. Very well. Make your best effort not to bore me with a yawn-inducing battle. Clear? Clear! Alrighty, let's do this. Round four, fight! And she looks sleepy. Like a Sleeping Beauty kind of beauty. Look at her, look at her. She's got like Rapunzel hair with Sleeping Beauty. So here she comes out with a Reuniclus. Reuniclus, that's what it's called, right? Wow, these, some of these Pokemon names are just like fantastically long and stuff. Alrighty, so going into the next screen right here, yes guys, we're playing, or we're battling uh, against El Elite for Caitlyn. She is a psychic type trainer, she does come out with four Pokemon, and as you probably already saw, she comes out with a level 48 Reu Reuniclus, Reuniclus, that's how you say it, it does come with a magic card ability, and it does have four moves, Energy Ball, Thunder, Focus Blast, and Psychic. The next Pokemon she has is a level 48 Musharna, and as you probably already know, it's a very tanky Pokemon. Does have synchronize, has four moves, reflect, charge beam, shadow ball, and psychic. And in the next Pokemon, Sigalith, the Gigalith. She does have a uh, psychic and flying type Pokemon right here, and it does have Wonder Skin. We already know what that does, don't know. And she does have a shadow ball, ice beam, air slash, and psychic attack. Now her final Pokemon, level 15, or level 50 Goth, uh, Goth Gothitelle, or whatever you like to say it, does have the ability Frisk. Does have four good moves: Calm Mind, Thunderbolt, Shadow Ball, and Psychic. Be aware of that Calm Mind because it will try to increase its special attack and everything else. It's just you know, fine and dandy. Do have a Dark type Pokemon just to beat this guy. All right, so let's go. Let's get this. Time to go with Crunch Attack right here. Alrighty, eat this Crunch. Okay, look at that. Look at that. And Reuniclus just oh, survives and it has a Focus Blast. Good God. And just like that, oh my god, and well, I get the fan, yeah, okay, so it's going to be exciting, so let's go with another crunch, she will try and heal her Pokemon, like you see right here, okay, alrighty, let's do this, okay, crunch attack, for the win, okay, come on, and nearly makes it faint, so let's go again with another crunch attack, why are you using full restore on this one Pokemon? You know you do have like two other, three, three other Pokemon, and well, here we go. Let's go with the Crunch Attack again. Bet you anything you don't have that many uh, full restores and all that stuff. So here we go, Crunch Attack, eat it. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Okay, alrighty, and here she comes out with a Sigil Lift. So I'm gonna switch it up. I'm gonna go with Ace right here because he does have a move that I kind of want to try out. It's a physical move, too, so it's going to be awesome right here. All right, bring it. Time to redeem yourself, Sigalith, or I mean Ace. Stutman from Scotland, and here we go, Wild Charge. Oh, yeah, eat this. It's a physical attack, of course. It's going to be very, very strong, and look at that, Sigalith defeated. Oh, yes. And, well, more experience points for all of us. Shatter 2, and here she comes out with a Goth to tell. So, let's go right ahead and, uh, you know what? Let's go with Drillmonger right here. He hasn't seen a battle just yet. He feels so left out, so might as well just do it right here. Let's go, Drillmonger. Okay. Got the tell. 
looking all gothic and everything, coming with its frisk. And, well, here we go. Earthquake attack. Alrighty. That's right, that's right. Look at that. Earthquake attack does its thing. Here comes its calm mine. It won't do nothing to me. Not yet. But, Drillmonger, he's got this. He's got this. Here we go. Earthquake attack. Finish him. Or her, I should say. And, bam. Got the tail. Defeated. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Okay, so she's got Musharna right here, so let's go right ahead and use Giggle of myself because it does have a specific move that can defeat this guy. Alrighty, okay, let's go. Let's do this. Musharna, what's up? I kind of feel like they, there's like three more. Oh no, this is our last Pokemon. Okay, stay calm, cool, and collected. Never mind, here we go. Shadow Ball for the win. Alrighty. That's right, bud. Look at that, Musharna. Oh, wow, Musharna took that hit, and here she comes out with a Shadow Ball herself. Oh, uh, this is some BS. Okay, so she's got more tank, uh, more power, more firepower than I do. But here we go, Dark Kamehameha for the win. And there we go, critical hit. Just when we need a hit, look at that, look at that. Okay, alrighty, alright, look at that, and uh, I'm throwing out the peace sign, guys. I'm throwing out that peace sign. Because we just defeated the Elite Four. And now we got a chance to take on the champion. Somehow you managed to defeat the entire Elite Four of the Pokemon League. Check the statue in the center of the plaza for the way uh, to the champion's room. Okay, alrighty. Okay. So, in the next episode, guys, it's going to be very, very interesting. It's going to be... Uh, yeah, it's going to be something to... It's going to be something to remember, okay? So... I'm having fun. I hope you guys are having fun watching this too. It's a. I'm, I'm assuming that when I come out with these episodes, it's going to be a small marathon for the Pokemon League. So, enjoy this quote-unquote marathon, and I'll be back for another episode of uh, Pokemon Black and all that crud. See you guys.